Hi everyone, in this video today I am going to show you how you can use your HiDisk AP80 as a high quality USB LDAC Bluetooth transmitter when you have your AP80 connected to a computer. Um, what this means is that um, you will be using the AP80 as a Bluetooth transmitter and I'll be using the um, HiBr3 as an LDAC receiver and it will do the transmission and the and the high BRT will be receiving the audio using the LDAC codec. So I made another video in my YouTube channel showing you how the LDAC codec works between these two devices and today I'm going to show you how you can use your AP80 connected to your computer via the USB-C cable I have over here and I have here a USB-C hub using a um, USB-A to USB-C adapter so that I'll be connecting this cable to it and showing you how you can use your AP80 as a USB audio device in your computer which your computer will see as a standard um, USB audio device however the AP80 will be transmitting the audio using the LDAC codec to the high br 3 I have here which will be receiving the audio of course um, using the LDAC codec as well because these two devices support the LDAC codec and what this basically means is that you can use your, a your AP80 device as a high quality LDAC Bluetooth transmitter in USB mode and that's great because you can basically um, use your high BR3 or another device that supports the LDAC codec and you can go around the house or you know do stuff um, while having the AP80 act as a transmitter a high quality Bluetooth transmitter so to start the first thing we'll need to do before before connecting the USB-C cable to the computer before we need to connect the AP80 to our high BR3 so first make sure that you have the Bluetooth enabled on both of your devices you can see I have Bluetooth enabled here um, I have Bluetooth enabled here as well so what I'm going to do is that I'm going to select on my um, high disk AP80 I'm going to select the high BR3 I have here so that it will connect to the high BR3 and the high BR3 will automatically enter into a Bluetooth receiving mode so now the high BR3 is connected to the high disk AP80 and it's ready to receive audio um, by default it always says um, SBC codec however um, once the transmission starts it will turn on to it will change to LDAC so next step is I'm going to connect the USB-C cable to the computer again um, I told that I'm using a, a USB hub here so I'll be connecting the USB-C cable to the computer there you go and we have got the AP80 turned into DAC mode and the high BR3 is still in Bluetooth mode however you see that the icon over the um, top right corner it's, it has the Bluetooth symbol and a music icon and an arrow saying that the music is being transmitted to the Bluetooth device and here I have the high, high BR3 um, using the balance audio connector that's why it says bow, bow over the top left there um, now um, the high BR3 I have the volume uh, I mean the high disk AP80 I have the volume set to 100% because that's the audio that will be sent to the that, that's the volume that will be, will be used to transmit the audio and then I can control the audio on my high BR3 so yeah um so going to the computer here i have the computer here first thing uh, i'm using tidal as well uh, first thing i want to do is go to the settings here and i'm going to streaming uh, what i want to do here is i want to set tidal um to use the high disk ap80 in wasabi mode so here you see I have um, use exclusive um, mode on and force volume is also on. Um, I don't select pass through MQA because um, this device doesn't support that. So now that I have said that, let's say that I want to play track number four from the Michael Jackson volume here. Um, thriller. Look at that magic. So the USB that mode just turned into 44.1 kilohertz. Um, uh, 24 bit this is the high disk AP80 and you can see that the high BR3 switched to LDAC mode and it's receiving audio at 44.1 kilohertz that's because um, I set um, title to use um, uh, wasabi mode on the high, B, uh, high disk AP80 uh, you can see also on the top left corner 
it has the L R letter it means that it's transferring it transmitting the audio using the LDAC codec which effectively we can prove because the high B R3 shows LDAC of 44.1 kHz so the sample rate matches and that's about it now I can continue to listen to my music I can listen to my music on my computer and the high disk IP80 will be acting as a high quality LDAC transmitter in USB mode and then I can uh, go around the house um, having the high BR3 connected to the um, high disk IP80 and I can listen to music and all of that and um, yeah a Tidal will send the music at 100% volume that's why I select um, first, um, the first volume option and then the AP80 also will have the volume set at 100% so uh, finally I control the volume in my high BR3 yeah that's basically it so I hope you like this video and it showed you how to use your high disk AP80 as a high quality USB Bluetooth transmitter using the LDAC codec and yeah so I hope you like this video um, if you did um, don't forget to comment on it um, share it with your friends uh, like this video and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you for watching